But anyways, this week we did make a huge step with extension of TPS. This was not easy. It was, it took so much work to get the Biden administration to take that step and they did. This is gonna help New York and this is gonna help people not only support themselves, but it's gonna help our economy. And I think that part is really important because we should be proud that these people are gonna be working in New York, that New York businesses are gonna be able to fill their employment needs because other states, Republican states, you know what they're doing out of a lack of, and out of a lack of desire to accept immigrants? They're rolling back child labor laws. They are so short on work and so unaccepting of new people that they are literally rolling back child labor laws and kids are getting hurt and kids because they're being made to do dangerous labor and they're getting hurt and that's what's happening over there but us in new york we are fighting for the resources and legal pathways so that we can have not just a community that continues to thrive but that we continue to commit to the american dream more than more than almost any other state in this country because new yorkers we want to protect a path to citizenship protect the american dream and protect the ability for people to come here with nothing but the shirt on their back and get a job and work and establish and provide a life for their family and when people say we want to do that legally quote unquote legally there are people that are choking and closing every legal pathway to migration in this country and you know what we did in new york we said we're not going to stop fighting until we open the legal pathways until we allow people to be documented and make it easier and so that happened this week 500,000 people i believe may be uh may be able to to access work permits and our economy is going to benefit from that. New York, New York's economy is going to benefit, has always and continue and will continue to benefit from the acceptance and from the, the ability to create a pathway and a future for anyone who wants to come here. And that is why that's one of the central reasons why we have one of the largest economies not just in the country but in the world and if these other republican states want to deal with their problems by putting 14 year olds into factories that's their prerogative but they are not governing in the best interest of their kids they're not governing in the best interests of their families and they're allowing hatred and racism and xenophobia to get into people's way and allow kids to get into harm's way by rolling back child labor laws instead of accepting new people that are here to fill our our economic needs as well as their own and that's that on that we got we got success on tps 